Hello everybody, welcome to the channel. Today, let's take a look at Horizon Forbidden West Complete Edition on Steam Deck Steam OS. This is a follow-up video because last time I installed the FSR 3.0 frame generation mod by Luke FC, uh, but we did have a lot of UI flickering because we couldn't enable the DLSS frame generation button. Okay, but now that's been fixed. I've been talking to Luke FC and he said something about um, the Linux version, it looks for the environment variables, wine loader, and when it detects that, it will disable the DOSS functions. So he fixed that. He disabled that 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 function, I guess. So if you take a look at my settings, display, full screen, 720p, all right, and you can see here, upscale method, DOSS, it's because I've got the mod installed. Okay, upscale quality on quality, and here's the main part, DOSS frame generation, before this was grayed out. But now we can toggle this on. So this helps a lot. All right, let's start a new game. And let's just test it out. Okay, so I was using a test build. This is a test build. But I think um, Luke FC is already um, releasing the new one. It's um, the Uniscalar Preview version 3. All right, so before it was uh, Preview 2, uh, it wasn't fixed. Uh, then I did some testing for him and now it's working with the preview 3. So I think when this video is up, that would be released. So look out for that. And you can see right now, we don't have any UI flickering. All right. And like the frame rate, uh, you can see it's like 40-ish, 50. Uh, the frame time is pretty high. It's higher than normal. But uh, yeah, that's just the side effect of these mods. I guess. Yeah, well, at least they make you feel better. All right, we should keep okay. going. Might want to grab more of these plants along the way. Yeah, good idea. So I haven't played very far on the on the Steam Deck. I've been playing on the Legion Go. But well, there's a big dip when you jump here. Yeah, I've been playing on the Legion Go. It is a better experience there. This game is like harder to run for the steam deck obviously but if that's all you've got if you've only got a steam deck and you want to play this game you might want to try out this mod so i'll show you how to install this mod later on i didn't show you how to install the mod in the previous video because uh the ui flickering wasn't fixed so i figured Figured uh, I'll do it with this one. Someone took down the hey. machine recently. Who else would come here? I don't know. We better craft some arrows of our own. There might be trouble up ahead. Good thing we already picked up some ridgewood. Okay, let's craft some arrows. There's a ladder. But can't reach. Nothing a well placed arrow can't knock free. What? Just have to target the lock. That did it. Okay. After you. Okay, so yeah, I think you know that it already works. So let's go into uh, desktop mode and I'll show you how to install this mod. I'll see you back in desktop mode. Welcome to my Steam Deck's desktop mode. So the first thing you need to do is obviously download the mods. And I think I've never showed you how to do that. You need to join the creator's Patreon. It's a paid mod, all right? So you need to join his Patreon, Luke FC. So once you've joined, you've got access to the Discord server. So this is the Discord server. And inside here, you go to mod releases. Okay, and here you can see this is what we want to download. Preview, Uniscalar. Okay, and you can see here, it's now 12.14. He just recently released it. So he released it 20 minutes ago. Preview number three. Okay, so that's the one we want. So it, you have to go to this website. And then it checks if you're, if you're eligible. All right, I am. And then you go here, latest version, preview three. And you just click these two. Download the common files and download the Uniscale. I've already done that just now so i'm not going to do it again all right and then you need to locate your game 
my game is right here in Games Horizon Forbidden West Complete Edition. This is where we're going to put our mod files. Okay, so you need to extract unscaler.zip. You need to extract this to the game folder. So I'm going to replace the old version that I just used. This is the latest one, Preview 3. And then unscaler common.zip. You also need to extract these, the whole thing. So winmm.dll, winmm.ini, and also the unscaler the folder. Just to drag it all over. Oops. I dragged it to the wrong place. Okay. You need to drag it to the game folder. All right. Here it is. Okay. I already have it. So I'm going to overwrite. Okay. And then you also need this file. Uh, see this? Stub. He, he's got it on the Discord server. I already downloaded that. So I'm also going to go there. And go to Luke FC's mods. Unscaler. This one. Stub. Okay, so we need to do this. Okay. Um, Horizon Forbidden West. So we need to extract nvngx.dll over. It's already there. And then you also need to extract enable signature override.reg. All right, put it somewhere you know you can access. I put it in my downloads folder. Okay, I already have it here. Okay. And then you also need one more file. I'll link it in the description. You need this dxgi.dll. So also copy this over. I've downloaded it. Copy it over. Override. Okay. You have to download that dxgi file.dll. It's um I linked it here. I'll I'll put the link in the description. These are some comments that I've been telling you about in the Discord. We're talking how to fix it for the um, Steam OS. So if you're on Linux and you're on Steam OS, you might want to... Right, this is the, the file. This proxy file. I'll link it in the description. It's currently at 0.1.1. Just download this. All right. And then open up Proton Tricks. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff to do. Open up Proton Tricks, go into Horizon Forbidden West. And we're going to run that enable signature override file. Okay, so select default wine prefix and then run reg edit. Okay. And then go to registry on the top left, import registry file. I put it in my downloads folder. It's easy access. And you just double click this. Enable signature override.reg. You should get this message. The keys and values contained in blah, blah, blah. Successfully added to the registry. Okay. And you're done. Then you can quit out of Proton Tricks. Okay. Go to your Steam. Okay. Horizon Forbidden West. Go to Manage Properties. And you just need to add this launch code. Wine DOL overrides equals win mm equals n comma b and then percentage command percentage and you're good to go. All right, now let's run it. Let's run it. You can see that's the mod window. We get this error message. It's okay. Just click okay, okay, and then if you go to settings, you can see we can toggle on DLSS frame generation. Before we couldn't do this. But now we can. All right, that's the key. That's the key. So it works now. All right, so that's how you do it. If you like this video, make sure you hit the thumbs up. Like this video, it really helps out the channel. And subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Later.